Today I will show you how to make a full AI music video from start to finish, using only one website. Let's begin. Hello everyone, it's Vivi. And that one website we will be using today is Polo AI. Now, it's important to know that Polo AI is an all-in-one tool for both AI image and video generation. It brings together all the latest AI models into one convenient place. I actually reviewed this platform a few months ago, but in AI, three months is a very long time. So, my old review is not useful anymore. The technology has improved so much. That's why today we will create a short music video from zero to finish inside their new Canvas mode. I will show you my full process, what works, and the important tips you need to know. We'll start by choosing the new feature, Canvas mode. Once you open it, you'll see an empty space like this. First, I'm going to design the character. I like to use an LLM like ChatGPT or Gemini to help me with ideas. You can keep your prompts on the canvas or use a notepad, but today I'll show you how to do everything inside the canvas. Click the text to image tab and choose your model. Personally, I like flux context the most because it can create new poses and backgrounds using only one reference picture. But first, I'll use a text prompt for the character in the prompt box. There are two options, context pro and max. Max costs double, but the quality is usually better. If the pose isn't difficult, you can try Pro first. You can also pick a style, or just leave it as Auto. After choosing the aspect ratio, click Create. It will take a moment to generate, and then the image will appear on the canvas. Now, I'll try Context Max with the same prompt to show you the difference. So, here are the results from Flux Context Pro and Max. What do you think? Maybe they don't look that different because my prompt was not very complicated. You can also try Flux Dev and choose Allura. Allura is a special model for a specific art style. Now, I'll use the image we just made to change the style with Flux Dev. As you can see, there are many Lora styles to try. For this example, I'll use this one. So, Here's the result from Flux Dev with the Laura. You can see the woman changed from Caucasian to Asian. This is because the Laura model I chose has an Asian art style, so the result is exactly what it should be. Next, I will ask an AI to give me ideas for the image prompts for each scene in the music video. Then, I will use Flux Context to generate the scene images from a reference picture. For this video, I'll use a different image, because I know most of my viewers like anime. Let's use this saber image. The process is similar to what I showed you before. You can generate as many pictures as you want for each scene. After I get all the images for each scene, I will organize the pictures on the canvas in the order of the scenes. Then, you can send each picture to the image to video mode and choose the video model you want. All the famous models like Kling, Hailua, and Vidu are here. The process to make a video is similar to making a picture. You choose the settings, click Create, and it will generate for a while. Then the video will appear on the canvas. You can try as many models as you want until you get a result that is okay for you. Then, you can organize the videos on the canvas and compare each model easily. This is something a single AI video website cannot do, because they only have their own model. It's still kind of difficult to get the video you like, 
Many times, you don't even know what you want, so try to imagine the scene clearly in your mind. This will help you not spend too much money for each scene, and try not to put many actions in one scene. One action is the most reliable. Two actions are okay if they are not complicated. You also need to think about the video length. Make sure all the actions you want can fit in the time. If not, the video might not finish the actions, or it will look strange. If you want the character in the video to sing or speak from a song or voice file you have, you can do that easily on the canvas by using the lip sync feature. The rest of the process is the same. Basically, you create the first image for each scene. You can even use Chat2 image powered by ChatGPT to create the image for you. Then you make it a video with the model you want. Then you use Lip Sync if you need it. After you get all the videos, you download them and combine them with a video editing software or app like CapCut, DaVinci Resolve, or Premiere Pro. So these are the final videos I got from testing the different models. Now let me show you the results so you can see how the same prompt looks on each one. <laughs> As you can see, for different images and prompts, you might prefer completely different models. It seems that some models are just better at certain types of prompts than others. And this, right here, is where a platform like Polo AI truly shines. Now, let's talk about how you can use this. Free users can generate up to two videos each day at no cost. Paid users get the benefits of creating multiple tasks at the same time, with no watermarks and full copyright protection. And a great tip for everyone. All users, regardless of their plan, can check in daily to earn free credits. It's kind of difficult to make a good video because you need experience in prompting and directing. I am not a music video producer, but at least now, everyone can create a video like this without spending so much money like in the past. You just need to practice and learn from other people. Today, AI can teach you almost everything, so try to use it and enjoy creating your dream project. Alright, that's everything for today's deep dive. If you enjoy videos about using AI for both productivity and fun entertainment projects like this, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe so you don't miss the next one. I would also love to hear your thoughts. Please leave a comment with your feedback so I can improve our next content together. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.